my business completely my business the conversations that I have with my husband my husband that's my business you know what I mean that's our business now if he chooses to share it with the help he can do that you know what I mean that's his life he can do whatever he wants to do but once again know your place you got to know your place you got to know your place okay so but but back to what I was saying <sighs> there's no way okay that I would ever feel less than less than who I am and what I've done in the past eight nine ten years of my life raising my children and being the best mother that I could be birthing my children marrying their father being with their father through whatever ups and downs we had once again our business okay yes it was brought onto social media and everybody wants to have an opinion about it cool awesome have your opinion honey but in real life i was with the person for eight nine years okay and nobody's gonna diminish that nobody's gonna make it seem like it didn't happen no one's gonna it, it, it happened unfortunately i was there okay so it is what it is and it's done now and it's over with um but things are gonna happen accordingly from this point on okay um but like i said and like i will keep saying like i will keep saying I will never feel less than standing next to a female that was not left once, left twice. He came back to me and I gave him back to you, sweetheart. Okay? And I'm not going to feel less than because he's with you now. I don't care. I don't want to be with him. That's fine. You 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 got you got your prize and you're you're doing what you're doing. Okay, cool. But everybody on social media, y'all can kill it. Y'all can kill it. Please kill it. Like, if things happen differently and things were like, oh, you know, like, if things happen differently, let me just say that. I'm not even going to get into detail. Then maybe I would have felt some type of way at some point. But never in this whole experience did I feel less than because the same shit he did to me, cheat on me, treat me like shit, ignore my calls, fuck other bitches, do this, do that, he did to her. So there was no growth. There was no nothing. There was, and, and I don't even want to speak on what they got going on because I don't care. But do I feel some type of way? Do I feel like I lost a good man? Not at all. Because there's been no growth. There's been no change. He cheated on me. He cheated on her. He went back to me. He went back to her. He married me. He went back to you. He came back to me after he went back to you. And I didn't want him no more. So I gave him back to you. Period. He can't be over here anymore. So he had no choice but to be with you understand that because that's how it went that's exactly how it went he walked up in that apartment got all his shit while i was sitting in the fucking car waiting for him and brought it back to my house and we were going to work on a relationship but then i didn't want to be with him no more period end of story that's it that's it it wasn't no oh my god I'm not. it wasn't no fairy tale no picket fence no fucking la di da story that's how it went Okay, and I know that hurts some people's feelings because they're like, no, there's no way he would want to be with Liv. Yes, he wanted to be with me very much so, but he couldn't, period. So he made do with what he had, period. And he thought taking my kids away from me would make me come running. Didn't work. Didn't work. Didn't work. Okay. So, like I said, <laughs> and like I will keep saying, I will never feel less than standing next to a female. I'm not even going to call you out your name. I'm not even going to call you a bitch. Because honest, honestly, baby, you, you, you hurt. You hurt, hurt over there. But I'll never feel less than standing next to you, sweetheart. Even if y'all run into the, in the sunset and get married congratulations i'll send you a gift honey bun okay i'll send you a gift because i didn't want him you know how meg the stallion says um bitch you'd have made you bagged him so you'd have made type shit yeah that's all it's just a reference you bagged my my my, my man my leftovers 
my baby daddy, my husband, my husband, whatever the fuck you want to call him, my leftovers. You bagged him up and took him home. Yeah. You're the maid. Period. And I will address you as such. Period. Like I said, know your place. And the help. Yeah, you're the help. People are like, oh my God, you should feel grateful because she is taking your kids to school and doing this and doing that okay the help she's helping she's assisting she's aiding and what the fuck i was already doing her father their father is doing <sighs> like i said it's all about knowing your place that's all it comes down to all of the trolls and the little uglies here on the internet the ones that look like the toucan sams and the big mama houses and the wesley snipes of youtube y'all can all get together and kick and cackle and y'all have a field day with what has gone on today you guys just laugh it up okay i know how you little ugly girls love to laugh and poke fun at the pretty bitch mm -hmm. i said it and it's okay because you guys live in the delusional land like like that chick does like oh my god it's just the delusions for me honey and I, like i said before i'm done i'm over it it doesn't even have to it doesn't even have to go this far anymore um i understand that this person is mad because a certain situation is happening um but baby what was done today that was not a good look it was not a good look it was not a good look um it's very frowned upon to speak down on the parents. Um, but you know what? It's okay. We're going to get it figured out. Like I said earlier, my lawyer liked that one. Liked it very much. So, um, I don't really know what else to say about that whole situation. You guys, I'm really just trying to move on with my life. I understand that people really want to stay relevant through me. Really want to be relevant through me. I always tell you guys this, I'm the star of this fucking show, period. If there was no Liv, there would be no none of these other irrelevant ass co-stars. Okay? So I'm just trying to move on. Like I said, let me move on. You feel special because you have my kids in your home for the moment. Feel special. Live it up. Live it up. Put them in gymnastics, fucking rugby, soccer, the football, basketball, bitch. Do it all. I'm paying for the shit. Do it all. Okay? Do it all. I hope they have a ball. Okay? Um, because you know what comes next. You know what comes next. So, so yeah. And all of this, I'm an unfit uh, parent. Unfit parent? Mm. Well, we're going to have to take that up with the judge, honey. Unfit unfit hmm those are some strong words sweetheart those are some really strong words super strong words i hope you can back that up i really hope people can back that up because when it comes down to it that's really frowned upon so like i said I don't really have nothing else to say i really hope people heal and people get through their own pain you know what i mean i could only imagine doing and and being in that person's situation um the guilt and the the feeling the fe like the the bad feelings that they have about you know the role that they've played in this whole thing because i don't know i've never been with a married man so i don't know what that type of what that feels like but um i could only imagine it must it may, it must weigh heavy on the heart you know what i mean it must weigh very heavy on the heart and for somebody who knows about the court case for you to call me an unfit parent when you know damn well why my kids are not with me right now it has nothing to do with my ability to parent or not it has to do with the money the money honey the money that my husband keeps stealing from me i can't do it look at you guys i can't control what other people do i can only control my outcome and the things that i do my actions okay so i'm not gonna 
go down to another person's level to get back at them or i'm not gonna i'm just not gonna play that game i'm gonna go the right route and i'm gonna handle the situation and when the when the situation gets handled the situation will get handled but as far as everything else understand that i'm handling everything you know um yeah i think there was a word custody in 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 the post there was a lot of words there was a lot of ooh, triggering words in that post and i'm just sitting back to myself and thinking what woman feels good about doing that what woman right keyword woman mm, i don't know honey i just i just don't know i just don't know but um like i said before i hope that everybody heals and gets through everything you guys on youtube 